On this episode of J Riding, we have the 2019 Mazda MX-5. Get out of the way. There it is. Beautiful, fun, fast, and manual. We've got three guests, John, Karen, and Tanya. We're going to drive around town with the top down and see if they can handle a Canadian winter and a convertible. Hi, Tanya. Hi, Jay. This is Tanya, right over there. This is Jay. I'm wearing two pairs of gloves. There's <laughs> this one, and because I hate the cold, I wear a long johns. We're in long johns right now. 2019 Mazda MX-5. Oh. The top is coming off. We're gonna drive around for a minute and see if bad. Tanya can, oh, let's close the windows. So brave Tanya has declined the heated seats. <laughs> the heat is on one. If you'd like to heat up, let me know. Okay, I'm gonna time her right there. Are you cold? I'm not, there's no wind in here. What's that, Tanya? <laughs> so it's been like 15 seconds. And we're betting not having long johns on. Long johns are definitely where it's at. I think the noise is going to be awful to hear us, so the window's up. I'm impressed with the lack of wind in here. I know, it's pretty nice. Yeah, Mazda, really good. good job. Yeah. So it's only 4 degrees, like it's not awfully cold and I didn't want to go in like minus 10 or 20 because I don't think that that's going to be good for the inside of any vehicle. No. Um, specifically, not the 2019 Mazda MX-5. You lucked out because we hit a stoplight. <laughs> <laughs> so there's not really anything to stop us right now. All right, I think you got 30 seconds left. Cool. What are you wearing? Uh... In a very non-creepy way. <laughs> Just for the point of the video. What are you, what are you I'm wearing, wearing a thinner turtleneck underneath a very heavy turtleneck underneath the warmest coat I've ever owned in my whole life. So <laughs> I'm pretty warm. Okay. Well, I if think if I had long johns on, I'd probably be fine. One hundred percent. You know, I've got like a dozen pairs, <laughs> sets, things of long johns. Okay, we're good. I think this has gone way more than a minute. So. Awesome. Sucks I for survived. you. You survived. All right. Stay tuned to see who's next. Thanks, Tanya. No problem. Next guest, John. Hey, what's up, everyone? He is the comedy writer for Modern Mississauga. And uh, yeah, got the top down. 2019 Mazda MX-5. Got the windows down. John has built-in beard. Yeah. And, uh, so, you know, I don't even think he needs a scarf. I think it's a bit of overkill. No, I was worried it's going to be a little, a little cold, but I got my hair billowing around my ears. <laughs> I got this beard keeping my face warm. And uh, your Feels sunglasses. My sunglasses. Are... I mean, not that sunny, but it helps. Eye health is so underrated. Yes. Look at me like a chump, right? Yeah. Exactly. I don't care about my redness. Yeah, but well, you just gotta look at me, and that's fine, right? But I gotta look at this beautiful face, so I need to. I need to keep these things in tip-top shape. And that's why he's modern Mississauga's comedy writer. Thanks, I appreciate it. You're welcome. So it's only five degrees, but it is uh, with the fifth today of January. Yeah. John, MX five, five degrees, January fifth. Is that fate? It's something. You know, it's always been my dream to drive one of these. You know, it's like, I'm 6'2", this is a little cozy for me, but I feel real sporty. Well, maybe we can talk to Mazda about getting a uh, Mazda yeah, MX-5 like, XL yeah, edition. Yeah, extended edition, do they yeah. do those? <laughs> they Probably might. not much of a market. <laughs> well, John, good job on surviving the, uh, the terrible five degree weather. Oh, great work. <laughs> that's me being sarcastic. No, that's fine. I just wanted to mention it in case. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah I do comedy, not sarcasm, I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay. All right, stay tuned to see who's next. All right, see ya. It's a convertible. It's me, so obviously Karen Rass has to be in the video. <laughs> it's our thing. It's but our thing. Usually it's the Canada Day weekend that we run around in the Mustang. It's normally a little bit warmer, warmer and more enjoyable, cooled seats, but... Um, but for first week of January, it's pretty fantastic. I'm, I'm not a huge winter person. I, I know you aren't I either. am not a winter person, but... This challenge is on. I'm gonna take down the windows. We're gonna be extra cold. Ugh. How do you not have a hat on? Oh, I am a 46 year old woman. I have internal heat like nobody's business. My other guests are great, but like, <laughs> how do you argue with that? You don't. How is your Christmas holidays, New Year, January been so far? Uh, happy to get back to work. It's really busy. I mean, you're cooking, you're cleaning, you're entertaining. 
entertaining, you're eating. You're everything -ing. You're doing everything. And there's a little downtime. I think I had one day where I did absolutely nothing and stayed in my jammies as long as possible. Oh, girl. And now here you are on January 5th, riding around with a top down in winter in this lovely 2019 Mazda. I feel like we should be having a conversation about global warming at this point. I'm ready for global warming <laughs> with my long johns. Well, it, I think I am global warming. It really comes down to resiliency <laughs> and adaptability, and if we're going to adapt, might as well be in a convertible piano. There you go. I should probably buy shares in Stanfields, the company that makes my long johns. I don't own a pair. And I used to ski. Well, aren't you just way braver than me? And it's weird because I'm like clearly heavier than you. I've clearly got more hair in my body than you, but yet I'm always cold. That's strange, eh? eh? Mike's cold at night, so when the hubby sleeps, he sleeps with an extra blanket, and I have the fan on. He calls it my airplane engine. <laughs> and I'm like, this is positively humid and hot. Well, Karen, I think one of our shorter episodes is this one. Thank you, Jay. A whopping two minutes and 17-ish seconds. What a fun spin. Yeah. yeah. Good job on surviving the cold. Thank well, you. Well, five degrees. It's all good. All right. If you think you can handle this thing, cold weather, next year, get at me in December. Sounds good. <laughs>